Hi, hello, welcome to today's session. In today's session, we will be discussing about whether a CPU or a GPU is best for data science projects. CPU is a central processing unit. GPU is a graphic processing unit. Now, CPU is made up of few cores, whereas GPU is made up of thousands of cores. CPU are mainly designed for serial processing, whereas GPU is mainly designed for parallel processing. Now, if you take any data science project, for example, let's take a convolution neural network or any deep neural network, it requires a lot of computational power. Especially the training phase requires most of resource intensive task. So if you want to uh, perform such a resource intensive task, then we can go for a GPU. Because in training phases, for example, you take a convolutional neural network, certain type of convolutional operations will be repeating. So those operations can be done parallelly to get a high throughput. So when your data set is very large or if you are dealing with some uh, images, then you can go for GPUs. GPUs are best suited for repetitive and highly parallel computing tasks. So can I replace a CPU with a GPU? Not at all. CPU are actually uh, possible to do a more versatile task. Whereas GPUs are not like that. It is for some specific purpose. If you take any server, you will be having some 24 to 48 CPUs, but you will be having only 4 to 8 GPUs. So CPU is like a brain of a computer. It is able to give instructions to many systems, including GPUs. So GPUs can just act as only as a coprocessor. It can never replace a CPU. In certain type of applications, CPU can perform better than GPUs. So CPUs can process the instructions very fastly and it can communicate. It's like an interactive uh, task. It can be done very fast with the help of CPU. But any repetition task which has to be uh, done uh, parallelly, then you can give that to GPUs. So any arithmetic calculations or scientific calculations or any uh, video rendering that can be done with the help of GPUs. So if you take any data science workflow, the jobs like pre-processing, feature engineering and visualization can be done much better with the help of GPUs. Now, if my laptop is having only CPU, now what should I do for a GPU? You need not buy high costly end machines. Instead, you can use the cloud service providers. For example, Microsoft Azure, AWS and Google, they provide GPUs. So you can use for any data science project. So this is what is the difference between a CPU and a GPU. We will see in the next session with another information. Thank you.